Hi everybody. I am going to show you my favorite uh, departure or flight path for practicing landing. I take off from Denver International Airport and I land at Rocky Mountain Metropolitan which is somehow KBJC. Can't, it's got to be some story to that. but. We are back. All right, let me get our little parking brake off. A little bit of the parking brake always seems to be the. There we go. All right. So this is flight is 21 nautical miles. I'm your Captain Data Juggler. I'm going to be your pilot this evening. I will let you know that I've only successfully landed two or three times and counting those as landings, meaning the plane was on the ground at an airport. Even on a runway once. And I almost have that video. I might publish it one day, but okay. We'll go ahead and get this little birdie off the ground. Ah, they're so... Okay. So now we are up and flying. I'm going to take the landing gear down for about two minutes, but we're only going about six or seven minutes. So it's not too far. I'm going to go ahead and now, I don't want to go very high, so I'll just hit an eight, eight, like once or twice, trying to get this thing a little leveled off. Again, don't want to go very, we'll give it a little bit of gas, so though, because we got to get level to the ground. Okay, I'll go ahead and show you our flight path. Okay, so we're currently on the right side of the flight path, and we are here's our landing path. There's probably some technical aeronautical fancy terms for all this, like Navy uses all kind of weird things instead of saying left or right when everybody would know what left or right meant, but that's okay. I don't have to know what aft means or any of that crap. I'm a civilian. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and turn our GPS tracking on too. I don't know why it's not on. Okay, so now it's a little flight. We're going to be going. Apologize for us flying into the sun here, but I'll close this so we can enjoy our visuals. And I'm going to very briefly go look in our cockpit. Uh, oops, something I just did. That. Okay. Okay, and I'm climbing. I don't really want to climb, so I'm going to go back over. Let me get out of here. I don't really like piloting from the cockpit. To me, it's much easier from here and much more scenic. So, okay, so I'm going to start going down a little lower because I don't want to go in a little slower. Oh, come on. Okay. And I'm going to start going off to the right just a little, but not too much. Because it's still a little ways till we get to our landing path. Alright. And let me kind of just, that should be a pretty good angle, I think. Let me go look at our little map here. See, at night you get a lot more visual clues because the airport is blinking. It's probably blinking somewhere down there now, but I don't see it yet. But maybe somebody else sees it. I love the way they even shine the water off the sun when the sun's up. It's like it's pretty amazing. I can't wait for ten years from now with this. If anybody watched the 1982 to 2020 of Flight Simulator, I can only imagine what the 2030 version is going to be like. Okay, we're whoa, we're here. Okay, sorry, I'm sitting here talking, and we'll go ahead and go ahead and put your trays in the upright position. Finish your beer. trying to before I land because I don't want to spill it on the landing all right going too fast I'd always yeah, I know just trying to get us a little into our little flight path and I'll start pulling this up a little okay kind of a combination my self-taught way of slowing down is just to get it F2 to hit 2 on the keypad to kind of raise you up, but hit F2 to not give it gas and 
in my understanding of physics that would slow you down with no gas and going up should make you go slower but I'm coming in real fast so I'm, I'm trying to but I'm trying to get in the little guidey thingies <sighs> well, well you know when you're trying to land pulling up is kind of counterintuitive instruction mister whoever you are and I am gonna pull up now that I went a little low well, I'm trying to sink. They keep telling you not to sink, and look where I'm at. Well, I know. Okay. <sighs> Anybody else agree that that don't sink is not helpful when you're trying to land? Seems like that should be your whole goal. So we're going to go around. They have a little holding path. I'll give it a little gas. <sighs> well, I'm trying to get up off the ground again. Okay. We didn't hit the ground. That's always a good thing. Okay, we're now looking for our go around little flight path. Um, Alright, so this is going to be a longer video than had been originally scheduled. Okay, let me level out a little bit here. I can tell you this. I wouldn't get into a plane for, since 9-11, and I'll never get into one now that I've played this game. That's all I can say. How pilots do it, I don't know. Okay, so we're trying to get going around. I can see the airport again. Okay, we're going the long way to get back around. There it is, but we're going to go, I want to go out a little more than they try to always send you. I want to try to go out a little bit and come back a little lower and slower. Low and slow is the way to go. Okay, so since we're going to be coming in there, I got to go off here. Alright, we're cruising. I may have to go get another beer here before I try to, since this flight's a little longer than I had originally planned. Alright, let me look at our little, alright, I went a little bit further out than I meant to, but that map is pretty small scale because it's such a short flight. Okay, so now we're going to start going down. Alright, we're out of beer. We're, we got to get up and get one out of the fridge. and So we're going to just get this uh, little birdie on the ground. Slowing us down. I'm going to start pulling out of our turn just a little. Okay. I know I'm going too fast. I'm okay, trying to get level. slow
I have to say that is my best landing if I can stop. Trying to stop here. Working on stopping. Alright folks, that's just showing you my landing I like to practice. Sorry I had to go around once and I kind of missed the runway, but that was by far my best landing. So I did do a little bounce and a little off the runway, but I came in at a pretty good angle. So anyway, thanks for watching. I just wanted to show you my favorite route, and it's actually better at night. So I'm going to re-record this for a nighttime landing, and maybe I'll get even closer to the runway this time. All right. This is Captain Data Juggler. Enjoy.